we move into an mm-hmm. uncertain future um, when there can seem to be so much um, uh, division amongst yeah. ourselves? I think like there's a problem of like, man, we have all these external problems. We have, you know, financial issues. Like, how how do we how do we move forward right. when we live in such a, a culture that can seem to thrive on like trying to be divided? Absolutely, yeah. I, and you're right, it's really tough because in some cases it feels like people could very um, obviously be afraid to move or do anything or say mm-hmm. anything because of this divisiveness that exists. But, you know, I, I, a couple of things I think are really important to remember. One is I, I saw this incredible study that that l- looked at so many Americans asking what, what we cared about. And no matter someone's socioeconomic level, no matter their gender, their race, their background, where they live, urban, rural, suburban, it all came down to people caring about their personal safety and and their own sense of of, of freedom and agency, meaning having control Mm -hmm. over your life, um, purpose, and having a true connection to others and to their community. And I think it's important to remember that that's just what makes us human. Mm -hmm. And that at the core, no matter what we see on TV, all of that still remains true. And there's some hopeful things happening right now. There is a lot of good news, um, not just in the outcomes and the results we see of, of what it means for neighbors to help neighbors, but I do see our community leaning in more, getting closer to the issues that really matter and being willing, um, being willing sometimes to be really uncomfortable in order to figure out how we can um, serve each other better. You know, I I can see that in my own life, I can see it at United Way, and I can see it across our community that people are recognizing that they've got power to change their community. Um, So one of the places I think I would say let's start in this divisive world is to recognize the the resources and the connectivity and the power that you have and that I have and that everyone listening to this has. We all have influence over something. And let's feel empowered by that. And then let's figure out what good we can do with it for our community. Um, I think that those simple things go a long way in, in healing some of the divisiveness. But let's also not forget what makes us human. Yeah. And it is that connectivity to each other. Um, and that's encouraging.